this is Daniel Hutchins and today we're going to be talking about another Cinema Blend article discussion. So today's Cinema Blend article discussion we're going to be talking about is Zack Snyder's Justice League. So okay, so Zack Snyder's Justice League sees what Carla Gugino could have looked like as Catwoman. Now this was hot off the truck today at 12.29 p.m. Okay. So Zack Snyder is hard at work on his version of Justice League. Bring in some surprise characters into the mix in the process. It'll be packed with characters when all is said and done. Including major DC villains like Lex Luthor and Deathstroke. Recently, Snyder appeared to be teasing Catwoman, and many fans pointed to Carla Gugino as a potential candidate for the role. Okay, so now a fan has given us a taste of what that could look like. Okay. So in Batman vs. Superman Dawn of Justice, many characters from Batman's world were surprisingly missing. Okay, so that includes Selina Kyle, Catwoman, since Zack Snyder is now tackling with Justice League. Many fans would love to see Carla Gugino make an appearance as Catwoman. Okay, so as evidence by this fan art, Recently posted on Instagram, you can check it out on cinemablend.com. And I have to admit, the picture of Catwoman is absolutely awesome. You can also check the, the picture on Instagram or Cinema Blend, so it doesn't matter where you see it. So, there's that you can keep in mind as well. So, wow, I have to admit, that looks dead on. And that Carla Gugino would finally fit the role of Catwoman like a glove. That being said, while Zack Snyder was teased the possible appearance of Catwoman in Justice League, there's been no clear confirmation that Carla Gugino will be playing her. But still, if Zack Snyder wants Catwoman in Justice League, he would make sense for him to pick Carla Gugino. He even previously admitted on a podcast that she would be a great choice. Okay. So Zack Snyder and Carla Gugino already have a firm working relationship. Watchmen fans will recall that she played Sally Jupiter's Silk Sanctuary in the 2008 film. Later she played Dr. Vera Gorski in Snyder's Sucker Punch and also offered her voice for Man of Steel and Batman vs. Superman, Dawn of Justice. So, if she were to be offered the Catwoman role, she'd be right at home with the idea. Okay, so if Catwoman does make an appearance in Justice League, it's hard to imagine she would have much of a role considering the already packed cast list. But would she make a mere cameo? Could she appear in a flashback scene to explain more of Batman's backstory? Whatever the case is, there's no doubt it would be cool to see her show up in some capacity or form or another. Okay, so the last time we saw Catwoman make a live action appearance was in Batman film with Anne Hathaway playing the character in Dark Knight Rises back in 2012. And regardless of whether we see Catwoman appear in Zack Snyder's Justice League, we know she'll be sh for sure that she'll be playing a role in Matt Reeves' upcoming film, The Batman, Mad Max Fury Road, actress Zoe Kravis, will be the one to don the claws in the film alongside Robert Pattinson's Batman. Okay, so 
Still, Carl Eugenio could easily tackle an older, more mature version of Catwoman. If not any other DC character, she's been an underrated actress who proven to surprise audiences with her performances time and time again. Now only time will tell if Zack Snyder taps her on to hop in the Justice League action when it debuts on HBO Max in 20 of 21. Okay, so that is it guys. That is the information I want to tell you for this specific article for Cinema Blend. So if you guys like this content, make sure you hit a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe. If you have any comments, leave them below. And you guys have a nice day. Bye.